Welcome along then to the circuit, Paul Ricard, home of the French Grand Prix, home race of the Renault team, and of course, a number of the drivers on the grid as well. Of the 14 races held here up until 1990, five were won by a Frenchman, and four of those, of course, were Alain Prost. I wonder who'll add their name to that winner's list today. Six lefts and nine rights give us a total of 15 corners here at the circuit Paul Ricard. And a lap covers an overall distance of 3.6 miles. Average speeds will be somewhere in the region of 142 miles per hour. And they'll be maxing out on the Mistral Strait at around 205 miles per hour. Joining me for today's race once again is Anthony Davidson. Let's talk briefly about Lewis Hamilton. As ever, the threat of unreliability is never far away, and indeed they'll be starting out of position today due to a power unit component change. So it's going to be a difficult task to move forward from there. Everyone has to deal with penalties or reliability issues from time to time throughout their career. You just have to suck up the pain and get on with the job at hand. Today isn't about performing a miracle to put the car back where it should be. It's about effective damage limitation. We're almost ready to go then, and this is what the starting grid looks like for today's race. Sebastian Vettel has a clear track ahead of him today. He starts in pole position, and Kimi Raikkonen completes the front row. Looking down the rest of the grid, we have Bottas, Ricardo, Nico Hülkenberg, and Verstappen, Sainz, Ocon, Perez, and Roman Grosjean. Hamilton, Leclerc, a Williams, and Alonso, Magnussen, Gasly, Brendan Hartley, and Stoffel van Dorn, Ericsson, and Lance Stroll rounds off the grid. Now it's almost time to lights out, so let's go down to the track. After the points finish of this race, let's aim to keep the momentum going. Velká teda fancie a je to moje premiéra na této trači. Teď asi pane byla jsem jste vytěl z trati z místa 13. předměr Louis Hamilton, který byl v pohledací nejtěžší, ale dostal pervenství 10 míst na startu. A proto se až z místa 11. <těk> Jede se na klub Polar Kada, Velká se Francie se se vrací v roce 2008, pak už uh, se ve Francii nejelo v rámci Formule 1 až letos a právě zde na této teči. <coughs> Je každopádně, můžeme nastat. Nasvětlí se červená světla. Za corner cutting. Polovin se mi strál už.
ini asik nanti
se to nikam posunulo, ten Rikardov konec. Je vais vous faire un peu de
information on Perez. They're slowing down. It seems like there's some kind of problem with their car.
minutes, 16.1 seconds. That's a fantastic performance from Ferrari. It hardly looks in doubt. So, Anne, how exactly did they set themselves apart from the pack today? Well, I'd, I'd say it's just raw pace, plain and simple. I mean, we could sit here and talk about strategy all day. You know, overtaking and looking after the tyres. But at the end of it all, if you want to win, you need a package that's got the speed over everyone else. And that's exactly what they had today. And now it's time to wind down and celebrate after that fantastic Grand Prix. Here they come, your top three, out onto the podium. And now let's take a look at the driver standards. Sebastian Vettel takes the lead of the drivers' championship. Moving on to the driver of the day, then, Anthony Davidson. Who would you go for? Uh, it's got to be Roman Grosjean. He was in another seat for me today. Really impressive. And now let's take a look at the constructors' standings. Ferrari extend their lead at the top of the championship. After all this drama, you'd be mad not to join us for the next race. We hope to see you then. Take care. Enjoy that. You made it look easy. You really cut your way through the field today. What was your strategy?
Ne, není nejlepší. Hmm. Myslím, že um, teď se kolem jich hrotek má nízkou mnohu taky Teď doufám, že jej zvýšíme. You're surpassing all expectations. Can anything or anyone stop you? Můžu mě si někdo na něco zastavit? Ale mám být sportman, tak myslím, že to je to bude showman, to je asi showman, a to to má být showmanství. It was more like dodgems than Formula One today, wasn't it? Jsem se taky na to fandomem. Bohužel se si uh, tu dovolu se stoflem až po konstaci, protože jsem taková dělavá. Teď se tím nebudu, ale dneska tři vody nepovedlo se. Mě zase klesla reputace, jak jsem říkal, no pak mě se bych říkal, uh, to je něco zaubilo McLehaný, taky v Fosindě. Všechny týmy. A tak, vše. It's time for us to renegotiate your contract. Here you can see the current deal. Once negotiations begin, the team will make you an offer. Hmm. You can accept if you like, but I strongly suggest we push for better terms. Our proposal has been accepted. The new contract will take effect on the next race weekend.